How's it going there YouTube? It's Root Junkie here and in today's video we're going to be showing you guys how to get root access on Android Lollipop, specifically on the Nexus devices. Nexus 5, Nexus 7 like I've got right here, Nexus 9, Nexus 10. Uh, Chainfire supports all these devices and does an excellent, excellent job and the process is basically the same on all of them. Just download the right file and you're good to go. So let's go do this. So to root your Nexus 9, Nexus 5, Nexus 7, any of your devices, Nexus 10 on Android Lollipop, Android 5.0, this is going to be the process. We're going to use CF Auto Root to do this. So your device can be unlocked or locked, it does not matter, bootloader I'm talking about there. Uh, and this will give you root access on these nice Nexus devices. So to do this, first thing you're going to want to do, obviously this is going to be for Lollipop. So should be running that on your device, so about and Android 5.0. All right. First thing you're going to do is go ahead and power off the device. Power off. And then to get this thing into download mode or bootloader mode is what we're going to do. So on this device and on most of them, you can hold volume up and down, but on this device, I know for me specifically, I had to hold um, volume down and power. Um, some of them do it a little differently. I also had to hold it for eh, about 10 minutes, or not 10 minutes, ha, about 5 or 10 seconds. So this puts us into um, bootloader mode. So from here, we can set this down and we'll plug it into our device. Highly recommend having, you know, at least 25% battery before doing this and plug it in. Now you guys can see on my device, I do have lock state unlocked. That means my bootloader is already unlocked, but it doesn't matter, you can run this nonetheless. So let's shoot over to my computer and show you the file we need to do this from Chainfire, and we'll run this tool. Okie dokie. So to do this, we're going to need right here CF Auto Root. This is from Chainfire, and we're just going to scroll all the way down here. You can see this process basically works the same with all these devices. Yes, he supports a ton of devices. This is an awesome developer. Highly recommend donating to him if you appreciate his work. So then we're going to come down here and we're going to look for our device. So, you know, if you have the Nexus 9, you'd want this file. And a Nexus 5, you'd want this file. And so on. Nexus 10, this file. So basically, I've got the Nexus 7. I'm going to look for Android version 5.0. My code name, there's my build number it works on. Code name there. Name Razor. Blank, blank, and hit download. So once you download it here, you can come here and download it again, and boom, you have the tool. So it's very simple. I already went ahead and took the tool right here. That's the download, the zip. I extracted it into a file called auto root. And you're left with these files. From here, it is cake. Just go ahead and hit um, root windows.bat. If you have Linux or Mac, you could run either of those two scripts and it will work exactly the same. So it's very nice that we have support for all computer platforms. So we're going to go ahead and I got Windows, so I'm going to run the Windows batch file. And it does tell you right here, warning, if you don't have your bootloader unlocked, see mine's unlocked, it will wipe all of your data and unlock it and then it will root your device. I have it unlocked already, so it's not going to wipe my data. But I'm just going to go ahead and hit continue. So press any key to continue and it's waiting for a device. So what I found in this state, if this happens to you, all you gotta do is come over here and scroll down to where it says reboot bootloader and then hit volume, or power I mean, and it'll select it. And as soon as it boots, the script will continue. There you go, and boom, it continues. So from here you can see on the program that uh, your bootloader is already unlocked. So just doing the boot image and rooting the device right there. Nice little red Android guy with the patch like a pirate. And it'll reboot in 10 seconds and you will have root access. We can go ahead and close the script on the computer by hitting enter. And you're done on the computer. Here you go guys, this will be your first boot up. Um, boot up shouldn't take too awfully long. Uh, it's not like you had to wipe data. Now if you did wipe data and you had to do the unlock part of this too where it does wipe out all of your data, 
you're going to have a different situation and you're going to see that it will take a long time to boot but for this process it should be fairly quick you did see a, a second boot there kind of two google logos um, that's going to be normal so don't freak out you're not in a boot loop you're good to go uh, you're going to see that when you use this root tool Android. So you do have a little Android is upgrading right here, a little optimization because it did install super user application when you did that. And there you go. You are done. So let's go ahead and just make sure we have root access. So if we scroll over, we have super user or super su. Uh, no thank you. And just to prove that it's working, I already have root checker installed. So I like to use this just to make sure we have root access. You can agree to that. Okay. Verify root. You should get a pop-up. There it is. Grant. And ba-boom, ba-boom. Congratulations. Your Nexus 7 on Android 5.0 is root or has root access. That's pretty much it, guys. Very, very simple to do. Um, absolutely awesome work from Chainfire. Like I said, this does work on the Nexus 5, Nexus 7, Nexus 9, Nexus 10, and tons of other devices that Chainfire supports. So there you go. Pretty simple process. A couple quick clicks, and you have root access on your Nexus device. Hope you guys like this video. Please stay tuned for more on the Nexus devices. I'll be covering a lot of stuff on them. Hopefully the Nexus 6 really soon if it comes out. Uh, I really want to get that thing in hand and play with it. Uh, please subscribe if you like this content. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoy it. And we'll catch you guys in the next one. Root Junkie out. Yeah.